इंस्टेंट नूडल स्प्रिंग रोल्स हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू संजीव कपूर खजाना दिस इज सौरभ एंड आई एम हियर टू शेयर अ न्यू रेसिपी व्हिच इज अ पार्ट ऑफ सिंपल वेजिटेरियन कुकिंग सीरीज एंड आई एम श्योर इवन अ नॉन वेजिटेरियन वुड एंजॉय कुकिंग एंड रिलिशिंग इट सो लेट्स क्विकली स्टार्ट विद इंस्टेंट नूडल स्प्रिंग रोल्स फॉर इंस्टेंट नूडल स्प्रिंग रोल्स वी वुड रिक्वायर स्प्रिंग रोल शीट्स इंस्टेंट नूडल्स कैरेट्स कट इन टू जूलियंस कैप्सिकम कट इन टू जूलियंस श्रेडेड कैबेज रिफाइन फ्लावर सोया सॉस चॉप गार्लिक चॉप जिंजर विनेगर red chili sauce salt white pepper powder oil to deep fry so these were some very basic ingredients very easily available the main ingredient of our recipe is instant noodles now as you can see these are instant noodles which are out of the packet now this also has a taste maker which is included in the packet so what we would do is we would cook instant noodles according to the instructions on the packet and make it ready i have some ready over here So these are the instant noodles as you can see they are cooked and they are cooked with the taste maker so this would be the main important ingredient as part of our stuffing apart from that we would also add some vegetables which we would saute a little bit so let's start with sauteing our vegetables so for sauteing we would use some cabbage some carrots and some capsicum with some spices so let's start with that let's switch on the gas so let's add some oil we would allow the oil to heat and once it is heated we would add all our vegetables into it now the oil is heated now let's add some ginger and garlic which are chopped into the oil some chopped ginger and chopped garlic we would saute our ginger and garlic for a while and then add the vegetables now the ginger and garlic are nicely sauteed now we'll add carrots capsicum and cabbage we would toss them nicely along with this we would add some white pepper powder so here goes in some white pepper powder salt some soy sauce some red chili sauce and some vinegar and now we would give a nice toss to all these vegetables with all our sauces in it now we need to cook this nicely until our vegetables are nice and dry and no moisture is left in it so now we would cook all these things nicely now till these vegetables are getting dry and they are cooking they are getting sauteed what i would do is i would tell you a trick about these noodles and how do we cook it now when you cook these noodles according to the instructions these noodles turn to be a bit saucy but you don't have to do that you have to reduce a little bit amount of water in it so that these noodles are dry so when you get dry noodles they are good for stuffing in the spring roll so that's the trick now let's have a look at the vegetables as you can see they are nice and dry now what we would do is we would just add these noodles these are pre cooked noodles you would just add these and give it a nice toss so we would toss them so that the noodles the vegetables all the flavorings are mixed together let's remove them probably on a plate so that all these things cool down to room temperature these instant noodles which were sauteed with vegetables have now come down to room temperature so now they are ready for stuffing so let's keep them aside and start rolling our spring rolls for this we would take a spring roll sheet and we would make a slurry a slurry out of refined flour and a little bit of water now the slurry would help us sealing the edges of the spring rolls so we need a paste kind of a thing of refined flour and water which would seal the edges of the spring roll so the slurry is ready now let's start rolling our spring rolls but before that i have kept some oil for heating over here we would deep fry our spring rolls into this oil So let's start rolling our spring rolls. So this is how we go about it. We would place some stuffing over here like this. And now what we would do is we would apply the slurry on the edges of the sheet like this and similarly on the other side as well. And then we would turn the edges towards the inside. 
from both the sides and then roll the spring rolls like this. Now you have to make sure that the spring roll is rolled tightly and in the end over here we would again apply some of the slurry or the refined flour paste and then roll it completely. So this is our ready rolled spring roll. Similarly, we'll roll other spring roll as well. So these are our spring rolls. They are ready to be deep fried. So let's quickly deep fry them. We would deep fry them in medium hot oil so that they are nice and crispy. We would deep fry them until they are nice and crisp. Now the spring rolls are ready. They are nice and crisp. Here they are, nice and crisp spring rolls. Let's remove them on an absorbent paper. Let's switch off the gas and serve our spring rolls. So to serve, what we would do is, we would just diagonally cut them like this and we would place them in a bowl like this. So let's cut all the spring rolls and place them. So here they are, nice and crispy spring rolls with a twist of noodles in it. 